Hey everyone, how's it going? My name is Kyle. This is Kyle Plays Games. This is Euro Truck Simulator 2. And uh, I'm going to tell you right now, I'm going to make up a short, shorter than normal video. Uh, we're going to go from uh, Kuad or Kudadad Real. I, I still can't pronounce that one. I'm not going to be able to pronounce half of these things in uh, Spain. But we'll make a quick trip here and uh, make a shorter video because uh, currently I'm... Uh, on vacation and uh, I uh, just making up these videos ahead of time to be able to make up for the time I'm going to be gone and I really had to make these ones quick so anyway hope you enjoyed the video if you do be sure to leave a like on the video share the video do not forget to subscribe the, uh, to the channel and I almost flubbed up on my words there Pre pretty much did uh, but leave a comment also let me know what you think about the video in the comments down below and if you'd like to watch these videos happen live link is in the description down below for my twitch channel be sure to follow on twitch so you do not miss out next time I go live okay so we're not really tired but at the same time I don't want to do like a trip that is in the middle of the night. So let's find a resting spot. I don't really need to fill up. Um, we'll do the uh, viewpoint, photo trophy in case that's there, and city names because I don't know where I'm at. Um, where's the nearest resting spot? Probably where I just came from, pretty much. Uh, no, not really. Uh, but they're both the same distance away, practically. Hard to be able to tell. What's this distance here? That is 19 miles. Or we can go here, which is 21 miles. Okay. They're both basically the same, the same time frame. So let's just go here and set that for our navigational route here and uh, drive safe. Got a little stuck here on the uh, on the screen. Now remember, drive safe. Driving safe is only a suggestion in my book. But then again, you know, like if you want to follow the traffic laws here. All right. So my PC just updated, and so like uh, it looks like actually like everything looks like super clear. Like wow, Brenda. this is this is and impressive over how clear this is here. I should have updated this earlier. Um, but also, like, we're also having issues with frame rate for somehow, for some reason. I mean, look at this, it's stuck. All right, well, PC is having a difficult time. I was having a difficult time yesterday doing Flight Simulator 2, especially when it came to uh, making up... Um, Get ready to turn right. Yeah, it, this thing is uh, really working hard here. I think I'm gonna have to pause it for a second here once I get this thing back, because... Uh, this is not wanting to work correctly here. We gotta slow down, slow down here. Okay, let's pause this for a second here. Again, like this is like really working hard here. Okay, maybe I gotta I gotta turn down my settings somehow here. Let's go into system here. Let's do uh, main to options here. We gotta change the graphics because maybe the graphics got changed over because uh, graphics are super detailed and I need okay. So advanced settings here. I can't believe I have to do this here because I don't know like how to set this as scaling. Probably to bring that down. Let's go ahead and bring that down to 200% and let's try that. Texture quality. We do have high mirror distance. Okay. Let's try just at 200 because I don't have a. I, I think my graphics card probably just cannot handle um, all of that. So let's apply. Let's give that a shot. Still running hard. We're still really running hard. I mean, like, it looks fantastic, but I don't think it, I don't think my PC can handle like how smooth it is. Ah, that's a shame. Well, anyway, I might as well go ahead and add to it um, on the promote on the self promotion thing. If you would like to help me um, <laughs> upgrade my PC, I guess. Or support the channel that way. Um, there are some few links in the description, and um, I will gladly use that to update a graphics card <laughs> if I need it, because this is beautiful right now. But I can't, if my PC can't handle it. I'm gonna have to. I might have to scale this thing down to 100%. Like, 
I mean, the fact is that it's up, it was up to 300%. I didn't set it at that, by the way. So, um, I don't know why it was, it was set to that one, uh, but yeah, where it starts that, I'm going to have to scale it back down. I want to, let's just get to the resting spot and then I'll scale it down to a hundred and that's probably what, what it's going to have to need. I am, I am just in awe over how smooth it is though. Wow. I just wish it might, I wish they could handle it. Anyway, let's go ahead and uh, try to ignore it for the time being. Maybe it, maybe it'll catch up with itself. Nope, not really. Keep right, and then exit right. Like I already see the stuttering occasionally. Yep, there's another stutter. Okay, yeah. Just handle it until we can park. Right. Sorry about how the quality is. Uh, I I wasn't expecting it to be like this. Really wasn't. Really not even looking at the uh, oncoming traffic or the incoming traffic. Just trying to get to a spot here. Really got to slow it down. Didn't realize how fast I was traveling. Don't want to get hit with some one of those traffic cameras because they pop up on there real quick. Okay, let's pull into here. This is where the resting where spot is happens. at. And we'll just go right into here. We'll go to the far end one. Cut it in. Okay. Turn off the engine. Let's get a little bit of rest. Okay, it is 10 o'clock in the morning. Almost 10 o'clock in the morning. I'm going to scale this thing down a little bit more. And we'll get a little bit of... Uh, has a taste on the graphics here, but how much we get down to 150? I don't know what this is. I don't know. If you guys know um, how I can fit, how I can make sure that it looks as smooth as possible like that without my without the uh, stutter, please let me know in the comments. I'm willing to learn about how to fix that. But I'm gonna try this. I'm gonna try it for now because I'm literally on my own when I'm making this. We're back. Okay. Okay, we're fine. Everything's back. I just stopped talking during the time that it was uh, we've inverting into that. Okay. Hopefully that'll work. Let's find ourselves a job now. Freight market. Let's see what is available in our area here. All right. So we have wind turbine. That's a bit of far away here. I'm, up, I, I'm honestly, I'm gonna have to pick a smaller one. Wow, that really brings it. In. Then again, I can go into Madrid, and that would mean that the next one. This is a little too far out. I, I want something a little closer for me. Um, let me check the external contracts. But if I get to Madrid, that will give me um, an opportunity for special transport in the next video. So I may take advantage of that one. Let me take a look at what is here in on this angle here that brings me up well, through to the coastline but it's still too far away that's too far that's a little bit closer ah all right well well we do have a milk that could be sent there six thousand dollars for that one that wing turbine here well the wind turbine might be a little fun here with the uh, double axle <laughs> boy i have fun with those don't i Six thousand four thirty-nine for the uh, milk. How much is the other one? How much is the other one? Let's get, at least get some maximum quality in here. Okay, that's carbonated water, and uh, okay, let's do the external contracts. Let's at least get a world of trucks um, one in, and we want to do. Was it this one I had? No, it wasn't that one. Oh yeah, I was, I was down a page here. Yeah, let's go to the milk. Let's just take this and just accept that one for right now. I'm pretty sure I can handle it. Fingers crossed. You that or I'm gonna blow an axle. Boy, that'll be fun in this in in, in, in on this graphics card now. 
Might have to do with a little hesitation because of uh, tainting the smoothness of it. I don't know. Hello. I didn't realize I was going the wrong way. I did not. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm. Go I need to fix this. Okay, we're going all the way around here, and uh, I don't need to fill up. I'll just pick it up on my. I'll just do this now. Okay, cut through. No one's coming. No one was coming through. That's great. Either that, or I just really cut them off. We're just gonna drive around a massive circle. Okay, this is the way. Nope, that's not the way. That's not the way. All right, I'm really. I'll find a new route. I'm really having a hard time driving. Find a new route. Get back on the right track. Graphic stutter is really messing with me today. Okay, slow down, slow down. Only go the speed limit. It I'm might be helpful up. for you, Kyle. All right, we're clear. Keep right. Exit down. Totally ignoring the. Uh, turn signals during those roundabouts. I mean, there wasn't anybody around me. It's a good thing, too. 35 minutes away from the actual... Was that a, is that a hidden road? That's I think that's a hidden road right there. Oh, I still want to drive on it, but then again, like I said, I want to make this video as short as possible because of uh, just the fact that I have to do some bulk recordings. Uh, for the next couple of days. I know it doesn't matter for you guys right now because if you're watching on YouTube, like I'm already done with it, but currently if I'm if you're watching it on Twitch, then uh, yeah, you'll understand that I'm in a bit of a rush to get these ones done. Didn't quite help that my PC had to update and it took forever for it to get updated. And after it got updated, now the graphics card is a little tanky. And so it's great to get. I will say though, drop it down to 150. It seems to be running a little bit smoother, so kind of, kind of helpful. If I have a more, it's more powerful PC, I can find, I can be able to run it on that 300% scaling. Again, I didn't know I had that on 300% scaling, Keep right or if that was just, and then exit right. or if that was just changed over. I'm really stuck on that. I am, I, <laughs> I, I'm exit really not focusing right. on anything else besides that. I'm not even reading road signs because I can't read. <laughs> I can't read Spanish anyway. Uh, I hope no one's coming through here because I'm just gonna bolt through. Just sure to tackle somebody. Send him flying. It is a st okay. I can le I can at least read stop right here. Okay, so stop. You know, so nobody's showing up. Still try to be obey the law as best as possible. This is exactly where we picked up, where we dropped off the other item at, by the way. Get ready to turn left. Turn left, and then turn right. I'm back. You guys got a shipment for me? Turn right. You have arrived at your destination. Your route guidance is now finished. All right. Good. Turn around here. Don't smack into the building. Don't back into the, the cement wall either. That would not be good for your truck. I guarantee you one of them is going to give and it's not going to be the wall. Okay. All right, 114 miles, about two and a half hours to go. It, this is, like I said, this is going to be a short route. This could be a quick one. It would be hilarious if, like, I don't know if you could do it, but uh, if there was, like, multiple shipments um, in one spot, like, like you, you see it before, like, there's multiple shipments in one spot, but you're supposed to pick up yours. Can you pick up the wrong one and just deliver it? I mean, or just send it off? If you can, has anybody done it? 
and then turn right. And let me know what happened in the comments because I'm kind of curious to find turn out, right. like, you know, how much of a punishment you end up getting for delivering the wrong item. I mean, I doubt that the game even allows you to do it, but that would be that would be hilarious. Like, if you're just not paying attention, you just grab whatever it is you lined up to. You're like, you're not you're not even looking. Just like, oh, I'm just gonna back up, and, you know, to anything and just go pick it up. It's the wrong shipment, but oh well, they'll figure it out. Turn Trying to right. talk about anything possible besides the graphics. I think I'm doing a good job. I kind of straight away from it for like a minute. I do wonder if my if my truck can actually handle. I think it can because like if it didn't, it would have given me the caution sign, you know. Okay, I do have to look out. Okay, they are exiting, so we're fine. Like if I didn't have the capabilities, like it would have warned me, like with another like notification here that it would have been like, oh hey, you really have to uh, upgrade like the chassis or whatever to uh, be able to handle this load. Okay, I need to get over. I need to get in here. You better slow down because I'm coming in and there's nothing you can do about it. Just 108 miles to go. Very simple drive. You just It's just going to be a struggle for me to get up to speed. But, you know, a very smooth one, all things considered, I believe. I, I say that now because they had the very end of that sentence. Because uh, I could be dealing with, uh, I don't know, I mean, like, there could be some road construction up here or like a detour, and then all of a sudden, it's sent, you know, like, it adds like a whole bunch of time to this. I don't want that to happen on this one. I just want a very easy, smooth drive into Madrid. No kind of issue whatsoever. Speaking about for issues. Um, you see how that there's like that tire wear on the truck? Now, I doubt that anybody has ever done it before, but what happens if you get like a 100% tire wear or like a certain amount of tire wear that, do you get a flat tire? Does a tire pop on you in the middle of the game? These are the questions that I'm asking you, like to let me know in the comments, answer them in the comments if, if that is possible. Again, another one of those instances where, like, I don't really want to find out myself. Keep right, and then exit right. But I'm curious to know, like, do they add, like, those hazards in case if you, like, do not perform, exit. like, routine right. maintenance on your truck? Like, you imagine that, you know, like, you just end up driving along the highway and all of a sudden, boom, you know? And you gotta, like, you gotta call AAA for, like, roadside assistance, you gotta wait for it. I mean, then again, I mean, that that isn't really like, you know, like a uh, a thing that could be like, oh, hey, it uh, it only occurs if you have, like, super wear on the tire. I mean, like, it could just be like a thing of, like, it is like a very randomly generated event. I'm talking like a like a 0.1% chance that it would end up happening. Like, you would have to get really lucky as a player here just to, to have, it, or unlucky, I should say, uh, for that to even happen. I'm just kind of spitballing here, really, if I'm just, like, struggling to gain speed on this hill. This very mild, inclined hill. Like, it had to be, like, like I said, like a, like a, on the randomly generated occurrence, um, occurrence on the random gener randomness generator. I think I'm getting that point across. Like, if it's, like, just, like, a 1% chance that it happens to you, like, it's, like, driving right here, like, everything's fine, and then, like, it just, like, it just, a pop, you know? Maybe that happens? I don't know. The devs are probably listening to this one and probably like, you know what, I actually... But it would be an unfortunate thing to add to the game, but at the same time, like, it'd be like, well, you know, it could to make it and make more realism to it. That you'd have to really just, like, maintain your vehicle, like, on after each trip. 
But also other people would hate that too. It'd be like this like I wanna just like play casually and not have to worry about these things. Just to pick up and play, which that one I understand too. Yeah, and talk about a randomness generator right here. Got a big issue going on over here. I'm just gonna drive right on by. We're not even gonna worry about it. Nothing to see there besides, you know, just the computer not figuring out how to generate cars. I'm gonna turn off my lights. It's noon, I don't need them. I okay, still so keep on the driving lights. Let's keep on the driving lights because we are on the, on the motorway. And I don't want anybody claiming that they didn't see me. A giant red truck. This coast along, we finally got up to 56 miles per hour. Can't get any higher than that. The limitation kicks in. It's cool as long as we got up to speed finally. Very simple drive, really. We are under an hour to go. 36 just miles, 35 miles to go. I was hoping that would tick down when I said it, but it didn't. Someone's gonna be in the comments going on there. You don't know how to read numbers. It says, it says 36. And that's when I reply back with, thank you for watching my video. Be sure to subscribe. Plenty more um, crazy antics coming up here. There's a plane, is there a helicopter somewhere? I heard, heard a helicopter. Plenty more times you could probably call me out on something, I guess. Cause I'm gonna be, I don't know. I don't know. Gotta slow down up here. Why did we slow down? Why did all the why did the cars slow down here? All right, we're in Madrid. Eventually, we'll uh, technically discover it then. But we did just pass up the sign that said Madrid. So at some point, it'll pop up on the screen. I will stay left. And we are very close anyway. We are right at 10 miles left here. This is a cakewalk here. Very simple drive, that's what I needed to. Very easy going, no giant issue going on. Of course I have to uh, park it, that might be a, Keep right. another situation. Right. That might be the story to the whole video here. I think I've managed to Thanks. figure out the graphics right. thing at least, because I didn't, we did not get any hesitation anymore, so that is awesome. Yeah, the smoothness of like the steering wheel, like, you know, like everything is like so clear and I love it. No longer am I like squinting at trying to figure out, you know, like, oh, I never really squinted, but like, it took me a while to be able to read the dash. But this is a huge upgrade. Whatever they did to upgrade the, uh, to rework it, this is amazing. Thank you, devs, for, uh, doing that. That's all I like about these guys is that this game came out when? I mean, like, when did it, when did it actually come out? And they're still working on it? Is still like perfecting it. So great uh, that they're doing that. You know, a lot of them could just be like, okay, oh, hey, we made it and we're just gonna let it be, you know, like if you guys really want an upgrade on here, we'll make another game in, a, in the next year and you know, and you know, just like uh, some of the other That's companies right. do, which I cannot Take mention. But I do have a beef with one of them. Well, I'm just <laughs> have a gripe with them, I should say, not a beef, but yeah. Alright, coming through, coming through, nobody. Exit now. Go straight on. I'm gonna to have to turn here, so I'm gonna get over here. I can already see where the destination is at, so we're just gonna turn right on in, turn left here. Don't tip, don't tip. We're fine. Okay. Here we are. Safe and sound. Perfect. 
All right, and wow. Okay, right there. You, you're not even gonna make me drive all the way in? Let's play it safe. Ah, oh, you just pull in. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and try to get at least 40 XP here. This will be about 20 minutes of the video of me trying to back this thing up. Really, all I gotta do is just like straighten it out here and line it up here. And I am gonna get out of the truck in order to be able to see this a lot easier. And hopefully I can do this one shot, you know? That would be fantastic if I could pull that off. Alright, cut the wheel back, cut the wheel back. You don't wanna over you don't wanna overturn it. I overturned it. I already did. Alright, cut the wheel again, cut the wheel back. You can fix this, you can you can rescue it but without it. Uh, I don't know if it's gonna happen. I don't know if it's gonna happen. Ah man, this every time. I am <laughs> this is why I'm not a professional truck driver. I only do it I only do it for fun. Wait, wait. Let's slow it down, slow it down. Cut the wheel, cut the wheel. Man, oh man, that is almost perfect. I mean, like, the trailer part is perfect. I'm going to call it right there. But this, the cabin part, I'm just a little off. Ah, man, my, um, my OCD is really kicking in right there that I want to fix it. But at the same time, also tell myself, just take the money. And that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to drop it down. And let's get paid here. Because uh, I don't want to waste any more time with it. All right, so we got 6,439 euros. Not a whole lot of XP because it wasn't that much of a uh, distance on the delivery. It was only uh, 144 miles. Typically, my my uh, deliveries are, what, about 400, 500 miles, maybe? I think that's what it is. Really wanted to be a shorter one uh, with this one here. But uh, so I'm um, glad I got that one done. And uh, I, I'm just on to the next one, you know? Glad I got to Madrid. So uh, th now on the next one, hopefully I can get a special delivery, special transport one, and uh, we'll just um, be able to add to that part like a subcategory in uh, Euro Truck Simulator with a special transport. Looking forward to that. And fingers crossed that that can happen. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to leave a like on the video, share the video, and do not forget to subscribe to the channel. And let me know what you think about the video in the comments down below. And if you'd like to watch these videos happen live, link is in the description down below for my Twitch channel. Be sure to follow on Twitch so you do not miss out on the next time I go live. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in the next video.